I, I bought this modded earth from someone online. It was a really good deal, but it's got a little problem. Uh, hi everybody, oh, Tech Dweeb here. Yeah, so this monitor, I bought it from someone online. It was a really good deal. It was like $50. I like to have extra monitors around because, uh, you know, I like to make budget computers and sell them. And very often, somebody buying a budget gaming computer, they, they need a monitor, mouse and keyboard. So I'm always keeping my eye out for those kind of things. And uh, this one here, it was a really good deal, but as soon as I got it into my car, uh, I realized what was wrong. It smells like smoke. Like really, really bad smoke. Yeah, the person's house I bought it from, it did not look very clean. And uh, the person who sold it, you know, I don't like the stereotype, but they look like a smoker. Anyway, I cleaned it up the best I could. I wiped it down, but oh, it still smells like smoke really bad. You can tell on the back here, there's these vents. That's where the smell's coming out of. And uh, actually, when the monitor's been on for a little while, and it starts to warm up a bit. It really just smells up the whole room. Uh, I did something to try to fix it. <laughs> I put it in a garbage bag with uh, an opened package of baking soda. I heard that that's supposed to suck up the smell of things. I left it there for like two weeks and it still smells like smoke. Yeah, it did seem to help a little bit. So I think if you have an electronic device that's, you know, just, just maybe a little bit smoky, that might be uh, all you need to do. But uh, today I'm gonna try to really get the smoke out of this thing. And uh, I think it means I'm gonna have to take it apart. But uh, yeah, why don't you come along with me and uh, watch me take apart a monitor, see if we can wipe it out from the inside and see if it makes any difference. One little problem is I don't actually see where the screws are on this thing. Oh, you know what? The stand connects under these little things. I wonder if these come off. Oh, look at that. That popped up. That's good news. Let me see under there, baby. There we go. Okay, well, let's take off the stand now. And this is a nice little monitor. It's a little 900p 19-inch monitor. And these uh, 900p monitors, you can find them really cheap on Facebook and Craigslist. Uh, and uh, they're good for budget gaming rigs. Because 900p is actually a really good resolution for like, you know, lower end used old graphics cards. You know, like a GTX 1050 or a 950 or something, even a 750 Ti. 900p is a good mix of, you know, you don't have to go as low as 720p. And uh, the games still look really good. Okay, well that's a little crusty. Uh, it does smell like smoke a little bit under there. But I'm pretty sure all the major smoke smell is coming from its inside here. Alright, well now I can get a this little screw over here. There we go. And one thing I hate about taking apart monitors is uh, they always have these little clips on the inside. You know, uh, you probably remember that video I made where I fixed a broken monitor. Oh yeah, all the clips are on the outside. It's really hard to get at uh, the, the inside. Now let's see what we could do. Like uh, maybe start at the edges. You know your pry tool is not very good when your fingernail makes a better pry tool. This kind of thing, you, the only tool you need is patience. Now the key is you want to get it open without ruining the sides, making it all scratched up and ugly. And I decided to grab myself a little beverage to keep me company. Today's beverage of choice is a Fresca. Fresca is always a bit of a weird one. It's it's grapefruit pop. I mean, you don't usually expect the taste of grapefruit with a fizzy drink. It's really good though. One of my favorite beverages, to be honest. Oh, I heard a little pop. That's a good side. Sometimes, unless it's a bad side. Oh, there we go. I had success. I popped one of the clips. That's good. Time to bring out the, the big boy. This is my big pry tool. Now, pop of those clips. That's the stuff. Oh man, this is a tricky monitor. The worst part about doing this is that it smells so much like smoke. It's so gross. Any smokers out there, you guys quit quit that stuff. That's gross. It makes you smell gross. It makes your monitors smell gross. This is the most stubborn monitor I've ever disassembled. These things, these monitors are like a puzzle. You gotta just figure out 
the right angles and the which ones to do first. It's actually kind of fun. At least it is when you are not doing it with an expensive monitor that you could break. Did, did that do anything? It feels like it's more back together now than it was before I did that. Today's video is sponsored by Fresca. Fresca, natural grapefruit flavor. I really want to be done this part. I want to be done this about 10 minutes ago. Oh, okay, I got that off. Yep, there's smoke, a smell, all on the inside of here. See, that's the thing with smoke, is it gets into every little, every little corridor and crevice. Oh my gosh, I broke a couple of the clips. Can you see that? Yeah, I broke a few. Quite a few. Okay, so I believe we're gonna have to take this whole thing off and wipe off all the surfaces and then it'll get the inside of this thing too. Let's pull this up. Yeah, there we go. That's where the smell is all in there, I bet. Oh my gosh, this thing smells bad too. I don't know how I gotta clean that. Now we'll do what we can. The good thing about filming yourself to put it on YouTube is if you forget how it goes back together, you can just watch your video again. <laughs> okay. Okay, we'll take out the ribbon table too while we're here. Oh, it's actually like glued on. All right, maybe I'm not gonna touch that. Maybe I'll take it out over here. Okay, so. We gotta clean this as best we can while not getting, you know, too much water and fresca and spaghetti sauce all mixed in there. We'll wipe it off as good as we can. There's only so much you can do. Maybe we'll give it a little squirt of my mom's perfume to make it smell nice. And then, this is the main part, I think, because this is where the ventilation is and this is where the smell is coming from. So we're gonna clean out all the front and back of that. And we'll wipe off the back of the monitor as best we can. And that's all we're gonna be able to do. I hope it's enough. It's pretty crazy all the uh, all the steps you need to go through to get the smell of smoke out of something. I tried everything, but I couldn't get the smell off just by itself. I had to go deeper. This is where the smell is. It's all in all, in all the little parts of the, the monitor. All right, I gotta go get some towels and cleanser and I'll be right back. Okay, we got a spray bottle. I got some Lysol, powder, power f and fresh, with power and fresh. And uh, more importantly, it smells like cherry blossom and pomegranate essence. Oh yeah, this is gonna do a good job. I can feel it. And we got some paper towels too. I have a, a feeling, feeling deep down inside that it's gonna work. Oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> That's pretty gross. Pretty nasty. It's the nasty lady with her smoking. Yeah, look at that. Oh, God. <laughs> this one, I think I'm actually going to clean that one in the sink. So we'll just do this one right now. Now, like I said, I don't want to put too much liquid on there. So we're going to we're gonna just do what we can, you know. We'll just wipe it off and use a little bit of the cleaner on it. Oh, you know what? I got to do the front side, too. We don't want to leave any little bits because, you know, you just got to get it all well, as much as you can. The more you leave, the more chance there is that this entire process will be wasted. Yeah, look at that. See, I would have left that on the, on the edge of the screen if I didn't double check that. Okay, next up is this bad boy. Oh, it smells like my grandma's house. I got to let this dry for an hour before I uh, turn it on, though. Yeah, oh yeah, that's all the smoke smell right there. Yeah, gotta do the back too. It all smells gross. This whole thing is just sticky with a uh, smoky smell. Okay, done with the PCB. Now we'll move on to... This is where I think most of the smell was coming from. Because this is where the ventilation is, so I have a feeling if I can get this clean, get it smelling good, that that'll, that'll be the main thing that needs to happen. You know what, you guys? We're gonna take this guy over to the sink and wash it in the sink. Okay, oh, well, let's get it a really, really squeaky, sparkly clean, shall we? 
use lots of soap out of this one. <laughs> At the very least, if even if we didn't get all the spots with the smoke, at least it'll smell like a cherry blossom and pomegranate essence, which is good. Oh, we didn't wash the inside of the monitor, uh, the monitor plastic. Let's do that. All right, back to the sink, everybody. Uh, okay, this better freaking help. I'm gonna be really disappointed if this doesn't do anything. Okay, yeah, look, can you tell? Can you tell how gross that is? Everywhere I wiped, it was covered in like brown, smoky goo. Okay, let's get this guy back together. Well, we need the screen first. Now we need to put the PCB back into the thing. The thing, that's what it's called. This PCB's had a chance to dry. I'm not worried about it being wet in any way, so that should be fine, I hope. Now we just gotta remember which screws go where. Where did this go? This was up here, wasn't it? Already I could tell this made a huge difference. Like before I was taking this apart, all I could smell was smoke. Now it smells just like the cherry blossom and pomegranate. I don't even have a tiny little hint of smoke smell. Okay. Hardest part's done, I think. All right, we're gonna call that good enough. Uh, this front pedal connector is what I'm worried about. It has to be very specific place. Yeah, this goes like right there. Oh, okay. There's a little spot for it. That feels uh, pretty good, I hope. That's as good as it's gonna get for now. And now is the point where you really hope you put everything back together properly. And if you didn't forget anything, this monitor smells great now. It actually smells good. It smells like clean. I love it. And these little tabby things go back on. And the bottom. Okay. Well, I, I pulled over a little PC that I built. All right, so the moment of truth. Oh, the light came on. Hey, we have something on the screen. It's just there for a second. Okay, let's turn this guy on. Come on, baby. Oh, all right. Look at that. Oh, so, uh, yeah. I'm going to leave it for a day. And then tomorrow I'll give it the stiff test. And we'll give you my final thoughts. But I'm pretty, pretty hopeful that this worked out great. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Well, it's the next day, and uh, I did give it the stiff test already, but let's do it one more time on camera. Oh yeah, <laughs> I do not detect even the, the slightest little bit of a hit of a smoke spell. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that all that gross, yucky goop caught up on the inside, all the components there. The, the, the smoke spell, it never would have gone away. No matter how long you left it, it just would be there forever. And there's nothing you could do. The smoke spell, it's in that dusty goop that's in, that's in there. And you can't just get rid of it in any other way other than scrubbing it clean. Uh, I'm really happy that this worked. Saves another monitor from ending up at the dump. This will be a nice little game big monitor for one of my little budget builds. I hope you found this helpful. We're entertained by my colorful commentary. Uh, please let me know in the comments below. You ever have a, any piece of electronics that were ruined by somebody's gross smoking habits? Do you smoke? If you do, for, stop that. All right, stop. Just don't do that anymore. And uh, while you're down there, give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Or a thumbs down if you want to smoke your cigarettes and you don't care what I think. Subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. I'm Tech Dweeb. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. <laughs>